Hello everyone, welcome back to the northern coast. So, I'm just getting the the last application of fertilizer here onto our fields, our soybean fields. Now that they have, I think, the second growth stage here. Uh, wait, yeah, hold on a minute. This is a soybean, and that one is wheat, because I made that mistake last time, didn't I? So yeah, I'm just going to quickly go ahead and put this fertilizer on the fields and then I'm gonna go and tend to the cows since I did skip a day now to get the, the growth stage here and then we can probably start the harvest okay there is the fertilizing done on both of the fields there they are now fully fertilized so we should get the maximum amount of yield and yeah uh, off camera I did lime one of the fields since it did need be, to be doing and fertilized the first application and yeah with that wheat field I'll I'll bale up the the straw so I can sell it because we don't need any more straw now I'm just gonna park this fertilizer spreader up and then we'll check on the cows see what they need and probably skip till harvest or maybe, if they're good, I'll probably skip till harvest, then check on the cows. Because I think they might be good until, or good for another day. Should probably check on the prices here now since I skipped. Uh, where is it? Canola. Wow. That is a really bad price. Normally it's a, in the thousands. But yeah, I'm not selling right now. Because that is pretty bad. Well, right. Check on the cows. Here. Um, yeah, they should be good for another day, if I can skip. Oh, we have 8,000 litres of milk there. Slurry and manure. So, yeah, I'll, I'll go ahead and skip to the next day. So I'm skipped now to the next day and now you can see the price has gone way up now. And there was a great demand, but it was for like compost or something. So yeah, I will, once I finish off this harvest, I will sell everything because also here the soybeans is a good price. If I harvest the soybean field first, sell it straight away because that price is going down and then sell the canola, then I'll do the wheat field probably. Check on the cows again here. Yeah, they're going to need to be cleaned up a bit. So I'll go and get the the harvester set up on the soybean field on a worker for now. So we can sort the cows out. Yep, look at that. That is like a field of gold for us. <laughs> We're not doing too bad for money though. Plus we have all that canola in the storage. I'm going to go uh, do a headland first. And I'll put it on a worker. Probably do just one headland for now. But if I just leave it on real time, we should have enough time here to get it done. It's a pretty busy day today. On here. See, so yeah, I'll quickly go around and knock this headland off. Then set him on a worker. Just took off the headland and this top piece here like I always do. Then I brought the trailer over here just to unload so the helper can go off with the empty tank. Yeah, I really need 
another tractor. <laughs> I need more fields as well. I need everything. I was thinking about in maybe the next episode or the episode after, I'm going to cut all the grass fields again and get a loading wagon and silage them. So I'll just put this in the middle of the field here and let him go. Just so we can go and take care of some of our other jobs. See if he's going to go good. Okay, yeah, here we go. Cows, we have 21 now. Uh, yeah, milk is looking good. We could probably sell that. Uh, needs a bit of feed, some straw. Probably could top that up. Top the water up and clean them. I'll just run over there and turn the tap for the water straight away. And if you wouldn't noticed, I had one of those sweepers for cleaning up the mess in here. And I actually swapped it out for this other one that I was meant to buy in the first place, but I bought the wrong one. So you probably would have seen it over here, but I'm just going to use it right now, actually, to clean up right here in that thing. It's really handy for cleaning up the area. It's really cloudy today. So, yeah, anyway, um, with this thing, you literally just turn it on and drive over it. And it picks it up, and then you can just put it straight into your feeding trough. Open it up. Look at that magic. That's all it is. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I wonder if that bale shredder has some straw left in it. Oh, it does. Nice. We can just go along there, blow some straw into the pen. I know they don't need it, need it, but while I'm here, I might as well. I think it's on this side, isn't it? Oh, no, it's in the other door, isn't it? I hope it's this way. Uh, yeah, it looks like it would be this way. Haven't done it for a while. There we go. Nice. No more capacity for straw. Nice. Okay. I think I did put the sweeper in the way in this door, so I'm going to back out. I think I'll just leave this straw blower along this fence here because it was quite in the way over there where I had it last time. There's not much room at this yard. Guess if I put everything away, there would be. Alright, what do we need next? I mean, honestly, they got 8,000 liters of total mixed ration still. They should be good for a few days, so I don't need to worry about that. I just get it looking a bit better there with the straw and the the water and the cleaning them up a bit. And we can sell the milk also probably if we come over here. Yeah, so with this mod I have here, the animal pen extension I think it's called. You don't actually have to take it in the tanker and take it. You can just go like this and get the truck to come and pick it up. It's pretty cool. So there we go, we sold the milk. 12,578 pounds, that's really nice. Okay, so that's the cows taken care of. Didn't yeah, I'm not gonna feed them. I don't think they need it. I'm just gonna take over from this hired worker and I'm gonna finish off this field here. And that should be it for this episode, once I get this field done. And then next episode we'll yeah, I wanna get go ahead and sell that canola off and this soybean field. While well, they're a good price, and then we'll start on the wheat field and get that bailed up.
just got this last little bit here. And we have then harvest our harvested our gold. <laughs> yeah, this is like gold in farming some later. Uh, plus silages too, I guess. But yeah, I was thinking as I was cutting that field down, things we need to buy are probably another field and a loading wagon or a forge wagon, whatever you call it. Because, like I said at the start of the video, I want to pick up the grass from the fields and put them in the silage pit so we can sell. Because we have quite a few silage bales left over, which should be good enough for the cows for quite a bit. And if we get the silage pits with some grass in there, we should be able to sell for quite a bit of money. I'll just unload this combine here and then leave it in the field. Because I'm going to be taking it over to the wheat field for the next episode. Yeah, I don't know what fields I should be looking at here to buy. Um, maybe 13. It's 310,000 though. Uh, two, field 2 here. That's a pretty good price. I want something like a decent size. And it's going to be uh, like a crop field. One of these here. So we can plant more soybeans probably. And I'm going to leave that those soybeans in that tractor because we're going to go ahead and sell these in the next episode and the canola too so yeah awesome yeah that's going to be it for this episode I can't even remember what episode we're on right now but yeah <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one thanks for watching